What is going on everybody? Welcome to the Whole Strength YouTube channel. My name is Luke and today I'm bringing you guys some behind the scenes action um, at our warehouse in Grand Rapids, Michigan. So we moved into this warehouse back in October of 2021 and today we're going to be redesigning, reorganizing it. We've had a lot of new products and it's, it's time to um, kind of clean it up a little bit. So I just got in the car. Um, I'm going to head over to the warehouse but before we do that, if you guys are new here, be sure to hit the subscribe button, um, like this video, it helps us grow, and let us know if you guys wanna see more behind the scenes videos, but let's go. So now I'm gonna take you guys into the warehouse, show you what we were working with before the remodel. All right, so when we walk into the warehouse, turn the lights on here, this is what we're working with. So right, we got a little photo studio. Uh, we got a little kitchen area over here. And then this area is where Joe packages right now. He'll pick the stuff from over there, package it right there. We have a lot of boxes in here right now. And this is where we're currently storing all of our um, inventory. We have probably like 20-ish of these racks. Uh, as you can see, a lot of the shelves are pretty empty right now, but this is where we are currently holding everything. A lot of our women's stuff right here in front and then a lot of the stuff is in the boxes right now as we're transitioning over to the new format. So the first step was just to cut all the boxes. I'm using a box cutter here and the boxes are pretty thick so it actually takes quite a bit of effort to cut into them. But to get all 300 cut, it took us about two days. I only recorded myself cutting the boxes but Joseph and his dad helped out too. Waiting for nothing, wait So we just finished cutting up all the boxes. So, so far what we've done is we cut the hole in the middle, which is where we'll, um, once we fold it up, that's where we'll put all the product. And then we've cut little um, lines on each of these shorter slabs, which we'll show you what that does in a second. Okay, so the reason why we cut the slabs in the bottom like we did is because um, these are the test ones we did without cutting them at first. And you can see um, with some product in there. It's not completely full, but um, it's a little wobbly. And I mean, we're going to have these stacked up like I think four or five high. And so we want it to be stable. So on these ones where we didn't cut the slab, you can see it's wobbly. And then on these ones where we cut the slab, it just adds the extra stability. So once we had all the boxes cut, the next step was to tape them up. We wanted to make sure they were secure because we're going to use this for as long as we can and we don't want to have to go back and redo it. So um, we taped up the boxes quite a bit, but Joseph and his dad also helped me with this part. I'll let you in my chest for a moment now that I know you've been here before. All right, so quick update. We're almost done with our first row right here. Um, and so how it's going to work is each of these boxes will be a different size of a different product. Um, so right now, we've, I think we've got like hoodies um, filled up. So I think we, for most sizes, we go from small to double XL. So we would need five boxes, but some of them we might have some triple XLs. So, but yeah, good progress so far. Got a long ways to go though. Still got all that back there. What's up everyone? It is day three or four of the warehouse redesign now. Um, today is March 3rd. Uh, I just got to the warehouse, so I'm gonna take you guys inside and show you what we've been working on. But I also wanted to mention that tomorrow, March 4th, we'll be dropping our performance hoodies, um, a new color in navy and a restock. And then we're also restocking all of our performance t-shirts. And then the we have a new fabric and colors for stringers also. So by the time this video is up, those should be out. Hopefully there's still some in stock for you guys to get. Um, but yeah, we've been working on a lot of new stuff and we also have some streetwear, which will be coming out hopefully in the next month or so. So a lot of exciting stuff to come. All right, update on the photo studio. We still have this wall 
that um, Justin's dad is actually going to come in and knock this one down just so we have more room. So when you're taking photos from back here in the studio, there's um, kind of that wall wouldn't be in the way so we can get better angles. Over here, we got the mountain of uh, boxes that are taped up and ready to go. We have our first full row front and back completed. And Joe started filling them up with the inventory. So I think over here, we've got like the comfort hoodies, premium hoodies, and then these are the shorts. And then this side, um, he started filling out. These are our new stringers that are dropping March 4th. This will be past the time of the video, but um, yeah, this is what it's gonna look like. So we'll do the same thing right there. We're gonna do probably one like right here where that rack is, and then another one um, probably right there. So we have si space to go on both sides of it still, and then we gotta leave uh, a lot of room for the exit. Too. Let your All right, so we just got done with this section, which I'm gonna walk you guys through. It's our women's apparel. So starting off, we got the um, combat hoodies in rose, aqua, and black. And then we have sports bras. We have white, olive, uh, navy, I believe, black. And then we have um, our leggings, which is forest green, navy, black, and silver. So first section of the women's is done. Then I'll take you to the other side. So this side still has some work to do. We still have a lot of extra storage over here um, from stuff that we have a lot of quantity of. And then this will be the rest of the women's apparel. So I think we have a few more sports bra colors and essential tees. So we'll fill that up soon. And then we still need to clear out all of this because we will put another two rows right here. But yeah, we're making good progress so far. We now have three sides complete. Um, once we get this, we'll be two full rows. So we'll check back in soon. All right, guys, what's up? We're back in the warehouse and we forgot to um, print out these name plates right here. So we have to cut those up and put them on the ends of the boxes. So let me show you. This is what it'll look like. So we'll put it right there. And then, um, yeah, we'll have like the sizes and everything just so it's easier to read. All right, so as you can see the wall, this part's mostly done. Um, we got the wall out. We just have to have like a little separated here. We'll probably put wood boards lining right there, but photo studio is looking good. And then over here with the boxes, we are about as finished as we're gonna get for now. We still have a few open ones you can see over there for new products that are coming in, but we have the ability to expand on still um, as we have more products. But overall, pretty impressed with how it turned out. We still have a lot of room to add on if we need to, but for now, uh, it looks like we're about done. Come on in, it's not just for a day. It's forever on past eternity's game. Can't leave it now, I'm called for greater things. Cause my heart is yours and I'll always be this way. All right, guys, that's going to do it for the warehouse redesign. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to stay up to date with all of our videos. We're going to be trying to put out a video a week so you guys can hold us to that. But once again, thank you guys so much for watching and be decisive today. Action. Hey, guys, uh, thanks for watching our warehouse redesign. I uh, really appreciate it. Um, you know, it was a tough process, but uh, somehow we managed to get through it. Um, make sure to turn the subscribe button on and you'll see the content that we're going to post in the future. Um, we really appreciate it. 
Uh, pretty sure you, you know, joining us for now. And uh, thanks. Be decisive. <laughs>